What is up guys, Cobra here and welcome back to episode 12 of Pokemon Sun Randomizer Nuzlocke. We arrived on Ula Ula Island last episode and now we've got to head up to a bus stop I think apparently to uh, go and get our next encounter. You have trained, I think we already faced you actually. I need to find out where we even exit this place. I don't think you can, can you? Nope, you can't. Right. So we've got to go the normal way back, which is where we came from. Probably the way that Lily was blocking last episode, although... I'm gonna fly over to the. I'm gonna fly over there because I can't be asked to walk and get encounters. So uh, yeah, right, back here. Let's heal up because we actually have got a pretty hurt team from last time. Well, not pretty hurt, but the hurt anyway. Well, let's see if we can buy any Poker Balls as well. Yeah, we'll get five Ultra Balls in there. Why not? Makes it up to thirty. And then because those have to spend all the money, I'll buy one more Great Balls. We've got nineteen of those now. Wait, this is a technical machine shot. Oh, that's interesting. I don't know if these are randomised or not. I don't know, but uh, these are all ten thousand each. We've got Yawn. We've got Vine Whip. Could be quite good for certain Pokemon. We've got Telekinesis, we've got Morning Sun. We've got them all. Alright, so yeah, we do go here because, yeah. Cobra, would you mind if I ask you something? Pew. You want to go to the ruins? It's going to be that, innit? Yes. Yes, I want to take Nevi to visit the Ula Ula ruins, but they're located deep in, the large de in a large desert. I don't want to ask too much. I can't speak and I've skipped it now. Right now, I'm planning to visit Malay Library. There's a book that I want to look for there. Maybe you'd even be willing to help me? Probably not. I know that Malay Library is here within the city of Mali somewhere. Even though I even though I should be able to find it. Even I should be able to find it. I can do this. I can't read today. I can't read. There's also a Zygarde Cube uh, part there. I don't have any Zygarde Cube parts we've got now. We've got to be performing at least the first part of it, aren't we? What's happening now? Oh god, Rotom's out. Prezzo. Why, hello there, Rotom. Are you feeling nice and comfy there in that Pokedex of yours? Well, hello there. Good to meet you. I'm Oak, Samson Oak. I'm a Pokemon researcher. I'm looking into ve regional variants found around here. And you must be Cobra here. Young Kukui mentioned you to me. Rotom, you be, you be sure to help this fine young boy on his trip around the islands, all right? What do you think you're talking to? This is, of course, I'm doing that. Yeah. No, it's gone. And you, Cobra, I'll be trusting you to keep Rotom safe as well. The young fellow from Kalos who helped invent that Pokedex put a lot of work into it. And uh, as much love and care as any parent. I'll be free in the Malay Library if you ever need me. Feels right to stop by and chat any time. And if you're having trouble finding the library, just follow the Black Brick Road. Meaning the patterns on the on these paths, of course. Black Circle, Black Triangle, Black Square. Follow the pattern and it'll get you there. Yeah, by all. So I'm going to go to the friggin' library. Although... This looks like a bit of a route down here, so I'm going to go down here instead, if I'm allowed. Oh no, we won't be able to. You'll try going up, well, try, yeah. Oh, for God's sake, why do I have to go? I can't be arsed. Also, I've just got to find this library, which it shows on the map anyway. Oh my God, it's Shane! Cobra. I'm sorry, I ended up getting lost yet again. Well, you haven't. I wandered around completely lost until I ducked into the apparel shop. And I saw this outfit, and they said it was the last one they had in stock, so I bought it. Even though I don't think I'd have the guts to wear an outfit like it. Ha. Oh god, there's a ringing horse coming for us. But that woman working at the store did tell me where to find the library. So I guess you could say it was for all the best. Though the library was actually right past the apparel shop. If, it, if it, I'd just kept going. Oh my god. Yeek. Yeet. <laughs> Cobra, been a while, friend. Looks like your island challenge is coming along favourably. That must be pleasing to the tapu. So Cobra, who, this might, who might this be? Oh hello, my name is Lily. I told you this Mudsdale spoot you just now. Does it seem like you're a trial girl? What are you up to? Oh, I'm actually I'm studying the Tapu's ruins for various reasons of my own. Not some fine initiative. Fucking liar. I'd be happy to show you the way whenever, wherever you'd like to go. My Budsdale here is as sturdy as all get out. She can easily carry two. Thank you for your offer. Trade offer. Should I check out my library first row since we're here? No, it's not. Can't be arsed. I'd rather go and freaking catch Pokemon. It looks like Ulu Island has gone back to Pokemon Sun cutscene percent again. The book I'm looking for is very it's a very old one. It's a book that contains old myths and legends that Professor Burnett told me about. Those tales seem to suggest that Alola's legendary Pokemon came from another world. Did Lily say she'd be upstairs? That's what Rome said. I just literally saw it with my own eyes, so yeah. Must be a very valuable book, so I'm not sure if I'll be able to take it out of the library. This is what you're looking for, princess. It's a bit, a bit harsh. Well, it's titled The Light of Alola. 
It's just, um, read it aloud, shall I? I'll just read I can't, I can't read myself. Good job you're doing it. I can't be honest with you. The empty sky broke asunder, whole appear where it'd be more a single piece of paper. It was called the beast of the eyes of the sun. Pokemon sun. King of all about before it, the beast that shone. So like the sun, the eyes gone before against it, but the end, in the end, the beast of one. Andre Summers, and then did the beast of the eyes of the sun, since it's light in the line of kings, then did the beast that had one, bring nations to the salting. Beast of sun and beast of moon, through their union, they brought new life, brought your heir to the alone born, the island guardians would keep from strife. The ancient king sang their fangs from Sogolea with song of flute. Two tones rang out across the aisle, a perfect pair, even after new. There you go. Isn't it great? My dad's books are all great. Well, I mean, yes it is, but when you say your father, isn't this book very old? Whoa, a bit harsh. Yes, it belongs to my dad. So, wait, why is a name being revealed? She never even said a name. I know I don't look it. Oh, that's the name. Oh, surname maybe? I don't know, but my family used to be pretty much royalty. I hate to have all my dad's books moved here so they didn't get ruined by the Pokemon. I can tell you lots of other stories about all of too. You interested? No. That'd be wonderful. I'd be glad if you did. I think I'll stay here, but I know why you've come to Alula. Yes, yeah, so I can find that to do what I want to do. You want to go on another trial, won't you, Cobra? Good luck with it. I read that Alula is electric type trial. Can only be reached by the bus on Route 10. Yep, I've already been told that. Right, so I can go now. Good. So, I mean, Route 10, that's a new encounter. If we get to it. I wonder if we'll be able to go down here now, though. Now that we've been to the library, since that's why he was complaining about the police officer. He's still there, though. Yeah, he's let me go this time. Where's this, then? Oh, this is Route 11. I mean, it's a new encounter, we can go for it, so uh, I'm not going to run to you yet. I'm not even going to go down this route yet, because I want to do Route 10 first. But yeah, we can go. We can get a new encounter in this grass, so yep, yeah, Route 11 encounter is... Don't let there's any water. Oh, it's a... Well, there was a <laughs> Pokeball there, but I guess we're not getting it, and it is... Stellar Steel? What? Wait, what is this? No, I have a feeling this is a Lendry, you know, and I don't know it. What is this? Or is it an Ultra Beast or something? What is it? It's an Ultra Beast. Oh my god, it's a freaking Ultra Beast. Um, I should be more excited than I am. I'm going for a quick ball on this. This is Steel Flying, by the way. Let's just quick ball it. Yeah, it's an Ultra Beast, which is why it looks so weird. Okay, we didn't get it. the quick ball didn't work. He used Leech Seed. Oh great, oh shit. Right, oh my god. I might have to put this in the team, you know. The problem is you need beast balls to catch these well, I think. It's going to be quite hard to catch, I imagine. Oh my god, yeah, I don't think we're going to be able to get this. It's a 1% chance with an Ultra Ball because you're supposed to use beast balls to catch him. I'll see what it is with a beast ball. 25% chance, yeah. I don't think we're going to be able to get it. It's going to be so hard to get this. The best chance we'll get is a 6% chance. I mean, we're going to try for it, though. So I'm going to go to... Uh, we can't go to... We can't really go to... Yellow snow because of the grass typing and it's, and it's flying type. So I'm gonna go to a uh, Maggie instead because Scylla, Scylla Steel uh, is steel flying, as you probably guess by the name. It's using Leech Seed, which is good, which is absolutely great. Might only know Leech Seed. I mean, the problem is, I don't know if it's worth catching. We use uh, Thunder Wave though to paralyze it, it's avoided the attack. Use Smackdown. I did nothing. <laughs> I don't know if this is gonna be a viable. I might just kill it to be honest because I think it's just gonna be too much effort for something that. We're not even going to really catch because it's 1%. Let's just try Magnet Bomb, but it's not going to do a lot. I'm going to say fuck it and go for an Ultra Ball and see what happens. I doubt I'll get it, though. It's a 1.8% chance. Yeah, I thought not. Mega Drain. I've, this is just way too much effort, to be honest. I think I'm going to kill it because... It's just constantly draining my health. We're just going to we'll just have to waste a lot of heals, and it, it's only a 4% chance even if we do get it down to things, because we don't have Beast Balls. So I think I'm going to go to Gaza and kill it, because it's not just it's just not going to be viable at all. And we've already got... Uh, oh god, this might be super effective. Yeah, it is. I thought it would be. It's not, it didn't do that much, though. But yeah, I mean, it doesn't seem that good of a Pokemon, because it's not doing much damage there. But then again, I don't know if Ultra Beast stats are amazing in comparison. I can't actually remember. Um, but we, we have also already got Rayquaza, which is... Dragon flying, which I'd rather have that, so I am gonna go ahead and kill it. That didn't even kill it, actually. So we might actually we've actually created a better chance for itself. Using Mega Drain, which is a bit annoying. I'm I'm just gonna go for another incinerate and see what happens. If that gets onto Red Elf, I'm gonna, okay. I will try. I'll try a Pokeball. I will try a Pokeball. An Ultra Ball, even. Okay, still on red health, good. So the chance is the same. We'll see We'll see if it catches if it doesn't, then. We got one shape. Okay, there we go. Yeah, it's over. I'm not gonna bother. I'm not gonna bother. It's too much effort. Oh, shit. Oh, wait, no, it's not, a, it's not, a, it's not an attacking move. Okay, good. Right, yeah, we'll get rid of it with incinerate. I don't usually like to do that on encounters, but it would have just... 
cost us too much, really, in potions and stuff like that. Like, Maggie, that was taking a, tight, a slight bit of a battering there. But yeah, that's it. Right, so everyone's healed up there, so we're going to now head over to Route 10, which I believe is this way. Okay, that's Route 10. So what's, I, I want to know what's up here, then. Because we could be in for a third encounter here. What's up this way? Malaysia Outer Cave. Okay. Alright, we'll try and redeem his encounter. We'll get another one. Actually, we'll have to face that guy. I'm going to go around that way. There we go. Because I want to see if we can fish here. I don't think we can, can we? That's also Professor Oak's cousin there again. Oh, there's a knight there. A Jacoba. A Jaboka, very even. Right, it looks like there's only grass here. So, Malaysia Outer Cave encounter is... Let's go. I don't know why I'm leading with Moist, actually. I should be leading with uh, Bomber Snow. Duo Geon. Uh, I'm not bothered. Wait, I swear. Oh, wait, I feel like we've already got this Pokemon. Let's find out. Damn it. We don't have it. <laughs> um, okay, we'll Water Pulse here, whatever. Damn it, I wanted to redeem with the Cell and Cow there, but we didn't get it. Stop using Recover when I want to. How would you, how would you anticipate that I'm going to use that move to so use Recover? How do you know? Cheating, that's how you know. It's a 51% chance now anyway. We're just going to get its health low. We're not even going to bother trying to... Uh... Okay, I should use something a bit better than Quick Attack there. But yeah, I'm not even going to bother trying to paralyze it a row. I can just stay with Moist here. Although its health has gone right back up to full there, which is great. Let's Water Pulse you again. Okay, we've got, we've got you quite a bit down there. She's in the move now. Oh my god, that does a lot. Okay, I, I kind of like this. Let's uh, let's Ultra Ball you and get, and get you in a Pokeball and then never use you still, even though uh, I said I liked you. Okay, never mind. You don't want to be caught. Let's use Psy Shock again. This could be the end of Moist. You survived. Good. Right. Uh, Yellow Snow, put it to sleep, please. Grass Whistle. Get put to sleep, mate. Damn it, it'd be a 100% chance as well if it was asleep with the old health it had. What's it, what's it probably at now? Okay, 93% chance. Okay, we're just going to get this now. All I need to do was put it to sleep at first place. I didn't even need to attack it that much. If it actually kicks out at 93%. Come on. There we go. Duo, duo John. We've got it. Right, let's get out of this grass. Oh, right into the wrong place. We've got an, an item, an antidote. That's nice. Right. Yeah, we're not going to face you yet. Get quite a few trains to face, but let's try and not make it easy for ourselves for once. We'll have a slightly underlevel Pokemon. Or to us, they might be on par because I think we probably did quite a lot of trains in the other island. Right, I'm going to heal here and then we'll go and finally head off on Route 10. We will get another encounter, which will be good. Right, Route 10. We're actually going to face trains only this time, if we're really into any. Like him. Oh. Oh, wait. Well, that's our encounter. And I think I know what it was. Yeah, for fuck's sake. For it. For it. I don't fucking know. I didn't want it. Well, that's our encounter for Route 10. For fuck's sake. Let's just alter ball you now. I could. I should have just quick ball, actually. I bet it won't catch this now. It won't catch. I bet it won't catch. Please just catch, please. There we are. That's our encounter for Route 10. We're never going to speak of that ever again. I saw the tree and I thought, oh, look at that. And then it buddy jumped out of me, didn't it? So that's Route 10 gone. And I bet there was water on this route as well. Send you to a box. Right, yeah, don't care. Uh, we need to actually sort this Pokemon out here. Yeah? Lamp will come in. No, Gaza will come in because like, Gaza's the lowest level. So falling behind a bit there, Gaza. Got you to face them. Firefighter Alex. He's got one. And he sends it out. Guzzlord. Oh, God. It's freaking Guzzlord. Wait, is that a... Is that an Ultra Beast as well? Because that looks really weird. Yeah, it's an Ultra Beast. Can they start with the Ultra Beast today? Dark Dragon. He'll be weak to Ice, to be fair. He'll also be weak to Bug, so I'm going to send out a... Uh, lamp Steamroller. Yeah, that's, that's done so much, that. Uh, we'll send Signal Beam in to absolutely wreck you, mate. I like how my tiny little move did more than that thing. Oh, confuse him as well. Put yourself confusion then, please. No, it, of course it didn't, because it's the AI. And signal beam to finish it off. 
Ultra Beast, they should hopefully be a decent amount of XP. There we go, because Lord's down. We do, do you fear Firefight Relic? I am over there, we'll go and get that. Oh god, oh fuck's sake, I ran too near a tree. What was that? Oh my god, it's core guys. <laughs> it, well, if that was, I, I wish we'd got that before because then I, I could have had to, I would have had to re-encounter. Let's run from you, I bet we can't run. Oh fuck, no, I used Flame Burst, I mean that's fine because I'll actually defeat it, but... Yeah, I didn't want to do that, but you're getting Flame Burst anyway. Hopefully wreck you. Oh, for God's sake, at least you could have... Now I have to do another turn now, because I want to defeat it. I'm going to try to use Worry Seed again. But goodbye, go, guys. I'm very sorry. Right, let's go and get this item. Everstone, why would, did you ever want that? Uh, yes. Oh. Why is the Pokemon leaping out everywhere? Can they not? What's this one going to be? Oh my god, it's Porygon too. Yeah, I've got Magma Armor. Yeah, I'm not even going to buy. You're probably faster than me though. Oh, for God's sake. And now it's using agility, so I'll never be able to escape from it now. Run, Gazza, run. There we go. I know you're a snail, but like, be faster, please. Are you a trainer? Young boy with an iron challenge amulet. Your Pokemon are looking a bit tired. Oh my god, we can heal for free there. Oh, nice. <laughs> your Pokemon look healthy, she said. You a trainer? Yep. UT Andrea sends out. Mr. Mime, oh god. We need to poison steel ghost. I might just rocky him Zia to be fair. Also Ferinium Zia. Yeah, we'll go for Inferno Overdrive. I wanna actually see uh Ferinium Z being used. Go on. Looking very angry there, Gazza. Inferno Overdrive. Oh my god. It, that does not even- it's not even gonna kill it all that and it didn't even do anything hardly. Right, ancient power. I just can't bother to get- I can't bother to switch Gazza out. It'd be faster but I can't be able to switch it out at the same time. See how much ancient power does. Oh my god, you're terrible Gazza. Well, I mean you're attacked for everything Rose, but yeah. Um, we're just gonna use Maggie to make it easier. Psybeam, that's fine. Did quite a lot though. It was a crit, that's why. Mirror shot. Right back at you, mate, with a mirror shot. It's not gonna kill it, is it? Oh my god, what is this? This Mr. Mime's unbelievable. What IVs has this Mr. Mime got? Because I want it. It's amazing. Magnet bomb. Psybeam. It does so much to say it, it's weak, and then Bagger Bomb goes in and either Mr. Mime will be down. There we go. And Mag's now level 32 after that. I have to go back to that, to that woman to get my team healed, and Gaz's now level 29. What's the Rock Slide? You got Rock Throw, but now you got Rock Slide. I think they're the same move pretty much, but one's built a bit more powerful, so we're going to get Rock Throw and go with Rock Slide. Moist level 33. Everyone's leveling up here and you're still in Haze, but no, you can't. I, I don't even, I'm not even going to look at it. Keep on booms. And do I go and defeat her? That'll get us team healed again. Oh, for God's sake! I just wanted to finally pick up the items, so I thought I forgot to pick them up. Oh, for God's sake, it's Porygon 2 again! Why have I done it? It was just a repeat from earlier. We're not going to be able to run, are we? Because it's Gazza. Oh, no, no, it's because I've not defeated it. Okay, I'm not even going to bother now. I'm not even going to bother. Or should we actually just try and defeat it? Fine, we'll, we'll try and defeat it. Oh no, we don't need that. No, why are we doing this? <laughs> Wait, didn't appear. Have that, mate. Right, crunch. I'm going to crunch you this time. See if your physical's any better, Darren. Yeah, there we go. Your physicals are better. Right, you're finally down. We finally got rid of that pesky Porygon 2 that's been haunting Route 10 for years. You also learn Air Slash. Oh, he also wants to learn a flying type move at last. We've finally got a flying type move. I'll go rid of acid armor for that. All that for a sticky bar, but we can get more out of it. Psychic memory. Metal powder. Psychic memory again. <laughs> okay, interesting. I mean, I could sell it. Oh no, for God's sake. Even if you're not near it, it does it. I swear that was Shane. Oh no, it wasn't. It was Cedar. I thought it was Poliwhirl. <laughs> we'll make it to the top of this hill one day. Trainer there, though. Doesn't get a whole lot of people to where they need to go all at once, though I'd kind of like to see a whole herd of bride poker like tourists stampeding together. So, uh, oh god. Oh god, they're doing 
rapid, the rapid at a bus sign. Oh god. This could be a dull battle here, which is I'm actually looking forward to. What, Grunt A says, what? you never seen someone take a bus stop to go before? Hey yo, you're trying to steal our bus stop? Best go and find your own, you heard. We're actually going to have a battle over this, aren't we? Yep. No, it's just, why, is it, why is it always single battles? I want to do a double battle for once, but there's not many really double battles in this game. Bay leave. Oh god, you're fucked. God, I've got Gazer out front. I also have to face both of them. But I, I probably should do a double battle. Uh, incinerate. Magical leaf. That's going to do nothing. I'm, a, well, I'm part rock type. I don't know if that kind of cancels it out, but that's done a lot of damage. You know, this bay leaf might be the best Pokemon Team Skull have had yet. Incinerate. Bye. And there we go. Dang, I lost. That my home is gonna. It, what? We're not actually doing this, are we? We. St no. Why? Why can't we have just done a door battle? For God's sake. We just have to unnecessarily play this team skull intro twice now because we've had to do two battles. He's got a Sewaddle. That looks very grass-like and bug-like, so Gazza is perfect match for both of your Pokemon. Razorly, that's fine. I'm get Gazza gets a bit wrecked, though, by like moves that shouldn't really do much to him. But he's being like, Swaddle being wrecked now, so it's fine. And Yell says all 32, despite not even wrecking appearance this episode, which is weird for Yell Snow. Actually, it did, but not for long. Yo, think about the bus drivers. If we take this bus stop, they can all chill. Oh, I'm over this. Back to living large at the mansion. Hmm. Yeah, bye. All that just to get on a freaking bus. Cobra. Just go here. What's going on? Some Team Skull Punks just ran past me going in the other direction, yeah? I sure wish they challenged the league instead of getting up to no good all the time. The league? Ho oh, ho, you'll find out soon enough. Just wait, cousin. But first things first. If you want to head up Mount Hakulani, we should take the bus. It blast us up there to the top, yeah, as quick as a sky uppercut. Fucking go then. Are we going then or not? Yes, I do want to go there. Welcome aboard the Executor Express. I'll save driving record. Absolutely slay you. Come on, come on, climb in. That's one way to describe it. Oh, we're there already. That'll quick. Mount Hakulani. New encounter, possibly. Probably not though. Character's very happy looking at a fence there. Over here. What? Mount Hakulani is the second tallest mountain in the lower lane. And the tallest. What? Oh, <laughs> makes sense. Check it out, Cobra. Full on cutscene for this. You see that steep, jutting, majestic peak right over there? That's Mount Lana Kila, the highest peak in Alola. Tequila. It's the sacred spot, yeah. The closest you can get ever get to the legendary Pokemon of Alola. Said to be the Sun Incarnate. That's it right there, on the peak of Lana Kila. That's where I'll establish our Pokemon League. We'll get everyone who's finished their Iron Challenges, yeah, and up there on the peak of Mount Lakalini, they'll battle against the Kahunas to become the Island Challenge champion. I've always valued our old traditions here in Alola, but it's time to make the champion the world, the whole world, to make the champion the whole world will recognise. It's time to get our own Elite Four and make our own Pokemon League. Yeah. Good idea, to be fair. To think that someday the kiddos in Alola will be able to go from being the Island Challenge champion to the world champion. World champion? And then when we have our own champion, we can show the rest of the world what's so special about Alolan Pokemon and their trainers, yeah. I think the Sinnoh champion had beaten, to be fair. Right, there we go. Bit of a weird camera angle like, but yes, we'll, uh, we'll head in here. So what I'm going to do is just buy a few potions, if I can. From the trainers we've beaten. We can buy two eye potions. We don't have any, which is probably a bad idea, but yeah. Right, this guy, I'm assuming he's the cat trial captain. Yeah, because Kaku has just turned up randomly. Hey there. You're still as fine up as ever, eh, Royal? Ha, ah, Cobra, let me introduce you. This is Malane. Malane? Yeah. He runs the observatory here and also my just PC boxes. But he's not But he's not Hokulani's captain. Oh, he's not. But I was a captain once, my mass friend. It's Cobra, right? Thanks for coming all the way up to Hokulani to visit us. But our captain, Sofakult, Sofakult, 
He's a busy young man. How the hell do you say that? Always calculating comics paths or working on the Festival Plaza thing of his. Oh, I know who it is then because I friggin' clicked on it last episode, but I'm saying. So I'll just determine whether you're qualified to take on the trial. I'm glad to show you the skills of a trainer who toughened up while venturing alongside Kakui back in the day. Oh, we've got to face him, for God's sake. He's got three. It's like a Kahuna battle in itself. This Empoleon he starts with. So we definitely have to switch here. We to Fighting Ground Electric. So we're going to Maggie for that. Of course. Bubble Beam, that's fine. Oh my... Jesus Christ, I did a lot. I did 30. Alright, well this Spark should spark you out. It, it used Swagger then, luckily, but luckily it missed. It's not done a whole lot, has it? Oh, we've paralysed it though, good. We'll be faster then, and we can take out a Spark then, hopefully. Spark again. It used a full heal, you absolute bastard. So it's lost its paralysis now. Get it back, get it back, get it back. Damn it, it didn't get it back. Leftovers have helped heal up a bit though. I'll we'll go for Spark one more time. We should be fine. Even I'll use Fury Attack anyway. Yeah, we're fine, we're fine. I don't know why it's used that over the uh, over Bubble Beam, which did more. And Napoleon is down. And Gaz is on level 30. Monferno up next. Oh my god, he's got... That's it, he's got two Sinnoh starters. That's interesting. Uh, but yeah, we can go for Moist for that. Monferno comes out. Water Pulse. Fury Swipes, that's fine. Moist has got a lot of HP. 140 HP, bloody hell. Alright, Water Pulse goes in. That's a one shot from Moist there, very good. And finally, Sharpedo. Um, yeah, we can go back to Maggie for that and go for Spark. You swagger great. I'm gonna get hurt in confusion here. Here we go, get ready for it. Oh, we used it, well done. One shot, yes, we don't have to be affected by now, but it's got rough skin, so I've been hurt a slight bit, but it doesn't even matter. There we go, Shoppy does down. And Mag's on level 33. And he wants a flash cannon. That's a steel type move. It's his special 80 power. What is mirror shot? That is special. Okay, we replace mirror shot with that. And Lamp's on level 31. For some reason, <laughs> even though he's not really been involved. There we go. Well, well, you certainly seem qualified to take on the trial. Yeah, I think he's even stronger than we were at, we were at this point of our Alien trial. Alien challenge, even. One more thing, cousin. The name's Kakui. Who's this mass royal you're talking about? Alright, cousin. I'm heading back to Mali Garden. I figure how should be done eating Malasada by now, yeah? I'll make sure he makes it up here, too. Yeah, bye, lol. That guy's interesting, never my old buddy. Going to our observatory, Cobra. Am I supposed to be going there? I don't know. Right, and I think we'll leave it there. We'll do the trial next episode. So, guys, been Cobra playing Pokemon Sun Randomizer Nuzlocke, episode 12. Yeah, next episode will be the first trial of Ula Ula Island. I shall see you guys later.